five, four, three, two, one. Welcome, Welcome to, to Royale. Royale. So as you can see, we've done a little bit of changes both in your comments in the last video. Yeah, we did a little bit of uh, research on our comments that you guys sent through. Um, so as you can see, the rebranding. <laughs> so pretty. Right? It's very pretty and it's, we like it. Okay. <laughs> but uh, yeah, other than the rebranding, uh, we did a lot of research on uh, what you guys what you guys said to us about um, our logos and the way we speak. And yes, we are actually looking at the camera as we were asked to do. Um, so yeah, so guys, please just keep sending in those comments and uh, we've got a lot to get through to today. So um, let's dive right in. Yeah. All right, so games wise today, we're going to be looking at Prairie to Hunting Grounds, what's going on in the world of Fortnite. All right, so from my side, we're going to be looking at some series. So I'm going to be looking at One Division, and I'm going to be looking at Superman and Lois. Mortal Kombat, new Mortal Kombat movie, going to be uh, yeah. freaking yeah. insane. Yeah, in the words of Homer Simpson. Oh. Yeah. Sports-wise, we'll be looking at WWE WrestleMania 37. Predator, hunting grounds. What could be better than running around the jungle as a predator hunting the fire team? I'll tell you what can, being the fire team hunting the predator. So it's been a while since the game has been updated. The most recent addition to the game is a female Valkyrie Predator. Uh, which is phenomenal in game. Weapon is awesome, character customization is awesome, the look is awesome. Uh, I haven't played with a Predator model myself. Uh, it's been a while since I've played the game, but I've recently started getting back into it, especially since there was a rumor about an Egyptian Predator coming to the game. It's referred to in the Dutch tapes where um, Arnold or Dutch gets attacked by uh, a female Predator and he hardly gets away. That's what caused the, the netting scars on his face, which is very cool, very cool concept. Um, so yeah, that's rumored to be the next Predator DLC, which would be an Egyptian Predator, and call away for it. So, One Division. So first of all guys, I'm not gonna do any spoilers or anything else. So one thing I've noticed about this program 
is that you have to watch it. Uh, there's so much going on in the background, there's so much happening with the characters. Every time you think something is going to happen, it doesn't happen, and every time you, you, you things just come along that you don't expect. Um, so for the first episode, guys, I'm just going to give you a fair warning. The first episode is a bit weird for my like, um, and it gets even stranger as, as, as the series goes on. But if you can get through the first episode, guys, I, I really recommend this series because if you get through that first episode, then it just starts getting amazing. The story takes place after Avengers Endgame, after Vision had been killed. So what Wanda has ended up doing is she's ended up taking control of a whole entire town and she's wiped everybody's memories and she's wiped her own in the process and in doing so she's also brought vision back so that she can live her suburban and married life with her husband. So it sounds pretty simple from the start but as, as you go on um, things just get a little bit weirder and uh, there's more characters that start coming in from the Marvel Universe that all the all the big comic book fans will understand you know it just it just gets better as as, as you go along from episode to episode um the twists there you never see the twist coming and it's just it's just a really really good show so i honestly recommend you guys should go and watch this um we give it a royal 10 so definitely go take a look at this show when you get a chance and uh once again i just want to say thank you to disney plus for bringing us another good marvel show Wanda and Vision, aren't we a fine pair? This is our home now. I want us to fit in. Oh, this is gonna be a gas! Where did you two move from? How long have you been married? And why don't you have children yet? Our story. I think what my wife means to say is that we moved from... Moved from where? Married when? Damn it, why? Oh, Arthur, stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Like days of old, lighting the spark of love that fills me. Am I dead? No. Why would you think that? Because you are. couple you know oh I don't think that was ever in question <laughs>
So originally it was supposed to be Roman Reigns versus Edge, but obviously Daniel Bryan, um, I think, is there to take a lot more of the bumps <clears throat> than uh, Edge can handle. Uh, he's on the later stages of life, so you know he's, he's not the machine he once was. So Daniel Bryan is there to do a lot of the work on his behalf. The undercard match of WrestleMania that I'd like to speak about is Cesaro versus Seth Rollins. Um, I'm a big Cesaro fan, always have been. I really hope he wins. Fortnite Season 6, where do I start? Awesome, awesome, awesome event to start the season. Uh, we saw Jonesy obviously in his whole get up with all of the different hunters involved. You know, he had the, um, his tie of the headband, he has the chest gear from the Alien movies, he's got the glove of Ryu. Very, very cool, very cool to see all the hunters in the video as well. Uh, it was definitely something to behold. Um, so far in this season, we've seen the introduction of animals. So we've got boars as well as um, wolves and chickens in the game. Chickens are hilarious. I love them to bits. Um, the newest edition actually is raptors. It came out about a week or two ago Also, It's very cool having raptors in the game. Um, it kind of begs the question if they're going to bring out larger wildlife at some stage, maybe T-Rexes. That would be sick. I don't know how in the world you're going to defeat them. It's going to take like the whole map to defeat one T-Rex, but it's a cool concept. Uh, Storyline wise, uh, we've seen a couple of changes in the map, the, how can I say, the wild wild areas of the map are starting to take over more and more and more. Um, obviously the spire still being there with the zero point inside. Uh, also another cool thing happening in season 6, there is rumour that Dwayne The Rock Johnson is the voice for the foundation, um, which is the leader of the seven who obviously um, tried to pull together the zero point in the beginning. So personally, I'm loving that. Other things we've seen in Season 6, we've, they finally added Tomb Raider into the game, part of the Battle Pass. Um, there's some hilarious skins in the Battle Pass, like the chicken dude, I forget his name now, Cluck or something, but it's it's very weird character. Um, you know, you've got lots of cool skins in the Battle Pass. Um, they're not really, you know, it's the usual Fortnite um, creations, which is, I'm okay with that, that's very cool. Uh, you got the Spire Guard, you got alternate attire for, well, not really alternate attire, an emote for the Spire Guard where she takes off a mask, which is very cool. But yeah, it's a very cool season, looking forward to it. I'm, I'm really loving where it's going. Um, so yeah, we'll, we'll have to see where it goes from here. No matter how isolated we are, there is a primal force that binds us all, that drives us to adapt to journey forth in search of adventure. To never, ever give up. To face our deepest fears, no matter the consequences. To confront the darkness that lurks within. That primal force demands balance. has grown wild, and so must you.
first learned about this seven years ago. On a mission in Brazil to capture a wanted fugitive. When we got there, it tore through our unit in seconds. The target had superhuman abilities. It had the same marking you do, Cole. It's a birthmark. What do you mean? He was born with it. It's not a birthmark, Cole. It means you've been chosen. Throughout history, different cultures all over the world reference a great tournament of champions. That dragon marking? I think it's an invitation to fight for something known. Mortal Kombat. These are your champions. I'm Sonya. That's Kano. I'm Liu Kang. Thanks, Jax. Kong La. Lord Raiden. The fate of Earth is in our hands. No matter how many of my people you put in the ground. We will not fail. Kill them. I am Sub Zero. fucking beauty all right that's it from us guys thanks so much for watching um please please keep bringing in your comments um, we're always trying to make the show better uh negative positive we don't mind uh we're always thick-skinned uh, you kind of have to be with the internet nowadays but uh please please keep sending in your comments and uh hopefully we can keep putting a good show together for you guys and you guys will keep watching us every month yeah, like Kevin said, if you guys enjoyed it, thank you and thank you for the support and uh, we look forward to doing the next one. Thanks guys. Cheers for now. Three, two, welcome to Real. <laughs> Baby, I'm the only host here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and three, two, welcome to Real. We'll do it. Sorry, uh, I'm just saying it together again. <laughs> two, welcome, welcome to, to Real. Real. I'm Bach. What? <laughs> Welcome, Welcome to, to Royale. Royale. So as you can see, we've changed things up a bit. It's all pretty and sparkly. What do you think? I'm just thinking... Oh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Look, so I really mean, really what do you think? <laughs> um, we, we love it. Uh, hopefully you guys will like it as well. Um, so, we've got a lot to get through to... Uh, Today's show, um, I'm going to be starting off with games. Um, looking at Predator Hunting Grounds, Fortnite... What does that want to say? Series-wise, <laughs> we're looking at Lewis and Clark, One Division. Anything I'm missing? Superman and Lewis. Yes. Not, not Lewis and Clark. Lewis and Clark Good is point. what we remember. Like back there. Yes. <laughs> so Superman and Lewis, Superman not and Lewis and Clark. <laughs> we're looking at uh, Superman vs. Uh, Superman vs. Lewis. <laughs> Gee, that could be interesting. <laughs> they got the most. <laughs> <laughs> yes. And um, we're going to be reviewing a new one that's come out, uh, Superman and Lois. So, let's get into it. Cool. We've got sport. Crap! <laughs>